friends, welcome back to the channel. I'm Amber and I'm so glad you've joined me today for my Goodwill haul. If you haven't already, I'd like to invite you to subscribe to my channel. I post videos on my 103 pound weight loss journey, as well as my love for all things thrifting, my Goodwill hauls, um, my farmer's market haul, healthy eating, um, a little bit of quilting, uh, and so on. And travel videos, we just got back from New Hampshire, so I've recently posted our New Hampshire vacation videos. Check those out if you haven't already. So today, let's jump into my Goodwill haul. I found some really good things, you guys. It was pretty amazing. It's always treasure hunting. You never know what you're gonna find. So let's jump right in. My dad mentioned the other day that he would like um, to have a soup mug and we didn't have one with a handle already. So I found this, though it came with these plastic lids. Um, I got a blue one and a nice green one. They're by the brand Nantucket. Um, I'm really not familiar with it, but um, it says it's made in China, although it's distributed by Nantucket Distributing out of Massachusetts. So interesting, but it is a nice quality and it has that nice handle where you can just easily grab it white on the inside. Um, like I said, the, the lids are a little warped and I'm not even sure that we would really use those plastic lids very much, but um, very nice size mugs. Perfect for some soup and uh, sometimes he just likes to have some chicken noodle soup or some chicken broth, so that is perfect for him. It's not too heavy either, so that was wonderful. I've never really seen um, nice quality soup mugs there before, so I was happy to find those. And then I collect the Spice of Life Corning Ware, so found the nice deep casserole dish. I have one of these, at least one. <laughs> I might have to. Um, of course, it did not come with the lid, but I'll find that in one of my visits to Goodwill. Um, oh, I didn't mention the price on the soup mugs. They were $2.69 so a piece, so that was pretty good. Um, the Corningware, let's see, it was $5.69. Um, so most of the time, it, it's a little bit less than that, but you know, it is the big one, big deep one, so I'll take it. So I always like to add to my collection. I'm sure I really don't need anything else, but I got it while I was there. Um, and then I got these kind of cabinet risers racks for my daughter. Um, she mentioned that she would like to have some. These are great to um, set plates on top of or in the pantry also, if you uh, have a wooden solid uh, surface on the bottom. So these wound up being $2.84 and it's a set of three and they're the nice uh, plastic coated ones. So she will like that. Um, and then I got this really nice Christmassy uh, dish towel. It's 100% cotton and this was 75 cents and it's made in India. So it's really a nice quality. I just love the Christmas plaid on this. Love it. I am going to really enjoy that. And I found these springtime placemats, but um, I thought they were very colorful. So a set of four of these and they were 50 cents a piece and they're brand new. I think they were never used. So these will be great for the little breakfast nook uh, table where my dad sits and eats breakfast. So just something cheerful, colorful to look at in the springtime. So I always uh, try to find things, um, pick them up even if it's off season because, you know, eventually the seasons roll around. Um, and then one big treasure. Look at this beautiful pillow, you guys. I just love the ruffles. Love it, love it, love it. $4.69. And this is a, a feather pillow, very puffy. It honestly, it looks brand new. It's Cynthia Row Rowley. Um, I looked up her pillows online and they're every bit of $40, <laughs> every bit. So I was really happy to see this. I mean, it's really just nice and plush. I mean, you can see how it's like mint. 
just a nice tan. I, I love it, <laughs> love it. So that was one of my favorite finds recently. And then I really needed another cotton kind of thermal type blanket. I wasn't sure of the size of this uh, as it was on the hanger at the thrift store. Um, but I figured it was every bit of a queen. Well, I got it home and really opened it up. It's a king. <laughs> it's a king size. Um, let's see the price on this was $5 and 69 cents. And it's really in mint condition, a nice ivory color. And, um, I will really like that. It's not a terrible heavyweight. So that will be a plus <laughs> for me. <laughs> And then, as usual, I saved the best item for last because I like to do that. Um, I, it's for my daughter <laughs> and I had to get a running start because it's heavy. Um, I found this nice cast iron pot for her. She mentioned to me the other day that she would like to have one. And I'll take the lid off so I can show you the inside. But it's in very nice condition. Look at that. She um, kind of made some potatoes and onions. Uh, she sliced the potatoes really uh, thin with some onion, salt, and pepper the other night, but she said what I, she would really like to have is a cast iron pot to make them properly. So this was a little more than I usually spend on any one item. It was $14.69, uh, 64 cents. Um, but I figured that was still a good deal. <laughs> um, I don't know how much these run full price, but I'd say uh, I don't think you can find it for $14. And then the lid is very nice. So I think she's gonna really enjoy that. I texted it to her and she was like, oh mom, you're so sweet. <laughs> I think she's pretty excited. I was tempted to save her for Christmas, but I thought she could use the pick me up with all her busyness and studying during nursing school. I thought she would enjoy that. So that is my Goodwill haul for today. Um, I definitely say I found some good treasures. Really happy about the soup mugs too. I think we'll enjoy those. But uh, let me know in the comments below what was your favorite item in this haul. And like, subscribe, and I will see you soon. Take care.